in this video i will be explaining the female reproductive system and we'll also see how to draw it we begin with drawing the upper part extending it to form the fallopian tube and the tip of the fallopian tube to show projections that are called fimbriae the lines are then further extended down to form the uterus and the vagina inner part that is the wall of the uterus is shown by extending the line from the fallopian tube bringing it down to form a narrow opening and then the vagina then we draw the ovaries the oval structures there which are then connected to the part of the uterus the ovary is the main organ which produces the female hormones estrogen progesterone and the ovum the finger like projections of the fallopian tube is called fimbriae the funnel shaped structure of the fallopian tube is called infundibulum next to the infundibulum towards a slightly upper region is the ampulla and the part which is near the uterus is called as isthmus it is in this junction that fertilization happens the uterus has an outermost layer that is called as the perimetrium which is the outermost part next to the perimetrium is a thick muscular layer that is called as the myometrium the innermost layer is the most important part in the uterus that is the endometrium this endometrium shows regular thickening or proliferation during the menstrual cycle so it proliferates and then sheds off during the menstrual phase so this innermost part here is what we call as the endometrium so the uterine wall is made up of three parts that is perimetrium myometrium and the endometrium the small opening at the base of the uterus that is called as the cervix and next to that is the vagina which opens outside that is the opening of the female reproductive system outside it's also called as the birth canal so this is the structure of female reproductive system 